a gigantic spider crawled into a girl's mouth, directly devouring her brain. At this point, the girl had become a walking corpse, controlled by the spider. This group of mutant spiders attacked a group of camping college students, almost all of whom were wiped out, except for James, who ran the fastest. He was pursued relentlessly by a spider, scaring James to the point of crying. During his escape, he got into a car, which the spider also climbed onto. The spider still managed to crawl into the car through the sunroof. James opened the car door and kept running, knocking over obstacles along the way, but it seemed to no avail. Finally, he ran into a small warehouse and shut the door, thinking he was finally safe. However, there was a crack under the door. And the little spider sped up, jumped and soared, flying towards James in a flash. Luckily, James accidentally knocked a helmet off a table, which covered his face. He shook off the spider, picked up a hammer and smashed it at the spider, finally ending the crisis. Yet, James did not run away but armed himself. He was determined to kill all the puppets to prevent human civilization from being destroyed by these mutant spiders. One by one, his former friends were all burned to life by him, even his former crush after all the puppet people were wiped out by James. Unfortunately, a spider army also surrounded him. James put on his helmet, standing alone, ready to face his doomsday battle. As the sun rose the next day, the brave James ended the battle and drove off to other places where he was needed for rescue.